is Ina and I'm recording this on my web camera and I am going to be an overachiever as fuck by trying to make myself a cardigan for the first time. <laughs> I don't even know what I'm doing right now but hey I'm showing myself to the camera and I just finished work at 7 30 and this huge order of yarns arrived today. I thought I would challenge myself to make a cardigan. I don't know how long it'll take me because I work a 9 to 6 job but I'm going for it. So these are the colors that I got and it's actually based on my favorite scarf. I know it's not the exact same colors because I have poor judgment. <laughs> so now I am going to continue my crushes live. I'll continue watching him and I'm going to start crocheting this project. Okay, bye. Okay, hi. Before we get started, I would like you to know that this is not a tutorial. This is just me um, recording the process of making my first card again. And I will be linking all of the videos that I followed down below and of course giving credit to all of them. I just wanted to record this process because it's such a big project and I started crocheting in March and I just wanted to record all of it. So I hope that you'll enjoy this and I'll see you again. Um, just a little update, I guess. It's um, Tuesday, August 24th, and it's uh, roughly six minutes before midnight. It was supposed to be my bedtime, like, nearly an hour ago. I sleep at 11 p.m. <laughs> Such a crap muddy space. But anyway, I finished all of the first 17 squares for this cardigan, and it took me six six balls of yarns to finish up 17 squares and hours and hours of documentaries which i love i have this much yarn left i'm gonna move on to the next color now which is gray i don't know how long this will take me but we'll get there we're gonna work hard okay bye i'm gonna try to sleep now <laughs> Because it has been exactly a week since I started crocheting this card again. I am crocheting again and it's almost 11 p.m. I just wanted to share what I've done so far in the past week and these are all of the squares that I've done. 
Um, I don't think that I would be able to finish this um, shade because I am already down to my last ball of yarn and I still have like a couple of squares still but I ordered three more of this color and another five more yarns for the other colors I recall because I'm having a very long weekend I have a four day weekend which gives me a lot of time to crochet and I'm so excited I'm so happy with the progress this is a week's progress on top of my nine to five job <laughs> so the past week I've only been crocheting for a couple of hours after work and that's it but this weekend I'm going full-on crocheting mode and I'm so excited I'm so happy <sighs> okay I'm gonna crochet again now bye August 30 and I'm already down to my last ball of army green yarn and I've already done this much it's almost 5 p.m. and I'm just cozying it up because it's a very gloomy day I have some hot chocolate and I'm going to watch Harry Potter and crochet some more so squares I have 17 of this color 17 of this color and then I have 13 of this color I ran out of yarn and I bought it from a separate shop so I'm just waiting for that I don't know when it'll arrive I think I am gonna start with the ribbing um these are the yarns that I have left So it's just begun Saturday because it's almost 2 a.m. It's like 1.50 and um, I am almost done with the squares. Um, I'm gonna need 15 squares for the back panel of the cardigan and I just need three more. <laughs> I could have finished it earlier but my family and I binge watched a money heist in one sitting all evening oh my goodness I can't wait for it to suffer. um I'm still not feeling sleepy I should be editing a video right now but I kind of want to crochet some more uh, maybe finish one square and start with a new season of new girls and I just want to 
make this update because it has been exactly two weeks since I started this project. Okay, so it's almost 12.30 right now. Um, the past hour I had to redo this. Now, I just realized that it looks ugly. And now I want to do it again. And now that I'm nearly done attaching this whole panel to this, I realized that I attached it inside out. And I'm so frustrated. Maybe I should just go to sleep because I only had four hours of sleep last night. Okay, bye. Again, this is how it's looking right now. As you can see, very, very big on the sleeves. That's the back portion. Look. And uh, here's the other sleeve. Very, very junky. Hello. Um, it's Monday night and I'm, I changed angles for a little change, I guess. And I'm almost done with the bottom ribbing. And I think I'm gonna have to change colors for the size of the cardigan because I'm now down to my last ball of um, blue yarn and I don't have the same color anymore. So you know what, after working on this for nearly three weeks now, um, I realized I kind of want to make crochet vlogs, if that makes sense. Like a crochet with me, but one where I'm talking like what I'm doing right now maybe we can talk about different topics you can ask questions I don't know I don't even know how long this video will be and if you're still here this deep into the video thank you so much this is not a tutorial but just a documentation of how I'm making my first big big crochet project my first cardigan sweater and it's been actually fun for me and seeing just seeing the squares like put together yesterday made me really really happy that's why I kept on sharing it <laughs> but anyway let me know if you want content like this in the future hello this is a little update again I guess um today is Wednesday September 8th and we currently don't have electricity so i don't have work i can't work <laughs> and i'm going to continue the last dribbing because no work and i have free time no electricity and i'm gonna use this gray color because i ran out of yarn and as you can see there's the jacket behind me really excited and yeah, so it's really comfortable. It's a really comfortable day, but the wind is really strong here. And I'm just wearing my pajamas. And I am ready to crochet again. Um, I just woke up. <laughs> Sorry for my voice. But I finished attaching the ribbing on the side last night and this is the progress. Sorry for the length of my shirt. It's just really long and it looks like this. And now all that's left to attach are the cups that are there. 
and it's pretty much done now i just have to clean the stitches inside yay